An emotional day in court today as the trial of the man accused of killing a San Diego police officer finally got underway five years after it happened. Good evening. Thanks so much for joining us. I'm Marcella Lee. I'm Carlo Chiquetto. Jesse Gomez is accused of murdering Jonathan de Guzman and shooting his partner Wade Irwin in the Shelltown neighborhood back in July of 2016. His aide Shannon Handy was at the courthouse today. She has more on opening statements and talks about the dramatic body cam video showing fellow officers trying to save de Guzman's life. Marcella and Carlo, it's only day one of this trial, and already it was a very emotional day in court. Out of respect for the family, we are choosing not to show that video, but the officer whose body-worn camera captured it broke down as he took the stand describing what happened. My concerns were getting J.D. to professional medical help as quickly as we could. San Diego police officer Kelly Stewart was one of several officers who responded to Shelltown on July 28, 2016, the night officer Jonathan de Guzman was shot and killed while on duty. So when I got to officer de Guzman, he was in a slumped position, his chin was down, his eyes were closed, there was blood coming from his mouth, and he appeared to be very pale. I tried calling out to him, but there was no response. Stewart drove de Guzman to the hospital. He got emotional as he recalled doctors telling him de Guzman wasn't going to make it. Just didn't leave his side because I didn't want him to be alone. De Guzman, also known as JD, was with his partner, Wade Irwin, patrolling the area in a marked vehicle as part of the San Diego Police Department's gang suppression team. According to prosecutors, the pair spotted Jesse Gomez and another male walking and then split up when they saw the officers. Officer Irwin turned his car around and parked it and approached Gomez on foot. That's when Gomez shot Irwin in the neck, injuring him, and then walked over to the patrol car and shot JD. He turns his attention towards Officer de Guzman, who's seated in the police car, who hasn't even gotten out. And he turns his attention to him and he fires, not once, not twice, five times, emptying that gun. As for Gomez, his attorney says he was under the influence of meth and scared, claiming he didn't know who the officers were, adding Shelltown is known for its gang violence. On that night, on the streets of Shelltown, as a car slowly approached Jesse Gomez from behind in the darkness and a man confronted him from behind, Jesse Gomez was afraid for his life. The trial is expected to last between six and eight weeks. If convicted, Gomez could face the death penalty.